and I'm going to give you a little bit of an introduction to our company. Uh, as you know, we're a small commercial bank. Uh, being as such, some of our specialties include checking and savings accounts, credit cards, loans, investments, and insurance. Uh, these are products and services that we provide both to households as well as to corporations. Uh, Banco Popular was established in 1893. It was established in Puerto Rico. And uh, in, the U in the U.S. it was established in 1961. Okay. Uh, currently, they have offices in U.S., Puerto Rico, Caribbean, and throughout the Latin America. Uh, in, in the U.S., the states where we currently operate include New York, New Jersey, Illinois, Florida, and California. Currently, we have over 100 U.S. offices opened up, with 177 op offices open worldwide. Uh, our main office and our headquarters is in Puerto Rico, um, which is the largest bank in Puerto Rico. Uh, part of the way that we became the, the largest bank was that in 2007 we acquired many of the offices of Citibank and Smith Barney. Uh, just by making those part of our company, we thus just became the biggest bank in Puerto Rico. Uh, for anybody who's interested in investing, our ticker symbol is BPOP, which is traded on the NASDAQ. Um, and a little bit of the financials on the company. Last year we had $1.1 billion in transactions in the Caribbean and Latin America uh, and we're the number one depository institution in Puerto Rico. Um, our net losses, given the economic situations, are slowing. Um, based on September, our net losses for this year, for that quarter, were $125 million versus $668 million the previous year. Um, part of this is explained by the hard economic downturn that has happened worldwide. Uh, but in addition to that, the economic downturn is still affecting Puerto Rico to a greater extent than it is in the United States. As such, uh, what we see our company doing in the future is looking to expand its role in the U.S. in order to shelter itself from such economic conditions. Okay? Uh, as of now, for, for our foreseeable future, we don't see where uh, we're going to be seeing a turnaround, except for that our losses will be slowing until the, the economy recovers. Um, from last September to this September, our non-performing assets have increased by $1.1 billion. Uh, but in order to conserve capital, we've taken a couple steps. One of them is that we're exchanging preferred stock for regular stock. And we have su currently suspended dividends being paid on regular stocks. And part of the big goal of this is to conserve capital in order to expand our company in the U.S. Hi, my name is Victor and I'm going to talk about opportunities and threats which a small commercial bank like Bank Popular faces. I will start with opportunities and more specifically with the somewhat recent announcement by the Federal Reserve Chairman Ben Bernanke that the recession in the United States is officially over. Uh, this of course means that there will be better banking conditions present for our bank. Next opportunity are the historically low federal funds rate as well as discount rate which means that our bank can borrow funds cheaper rate and therefore this will lead to greater profit margin. Another opportunity is the positively sloping yield curve. This means that short-term interest rates are lower than long-term interest rates and this will yet again lead to higher profit margins. The next opportunity stems from the fact that although Banco Popular is Puerto Rican bank, Puerto Rico is uh, unincorporated self-governing territory of the United States and therefore it enjoys the benefits of the U US legislative system as well as the stability of the dollar. This uh, eliminates to a great extent the political risk as well as the foreign exchange risk to our bank. Last but not least is the invaluable opportunity in front of Bank Popular to expand in the United States. This will allow the bank to reach millions of potential new customers. Next I will talk about the threats and I will start with the uh, one most common for almost every business in the world except for monopolies of course and this is the threat of competition. Uh, bank Popular faces a lot of competition and its main competitors are the largest commercial banks such as uh, Bank of America, Citibank, Chase. These banks have immense amount of capital, it will be very hard for our bank to compete for them for a market share. The next threat stems from the fact that although uh, recession is officially over, the general economic conditions are still low, there is uh, economic pressure, the unemployment rate is rising and the values of the housing and commercial properties are falling. Another threat uh, comes from the business risk which are endemic to almost every financial institution. For bank for bank popular the major ones are identified to be credit risk, liquidity risk, interest rate risk, as well as foreign exchange risk. The next threat are the new tight on government regulations, each, uh, which if voted 
will entail lower reserve requirements, uh, I mean high reserve requirements, lower leverage, uh, as well as lower management compensation. Finally, because the bank received money from the Troubled Asset Relief Program, TAR or TARP, uh, it is required to comply with even more government regulations and provisions. This have to do with the levels of risk, uh, with the dividend declaration and stock repurchase. In conclusion, I can say that although there are many opportunities in front of the bank, the management should be vigilant because the long-lasting effects of the recession are still present. Thank you. Hello, my name is Fabiola Albinez and I'll be talking to you about the employment opportunities that Banco Popular has to offer. To get where you want to be, Banco Popular has a development center that puts at your fingertips a variety of experiences for your professional and personal growth. They offer an ample array of courses and development processes that will allow you to obtain your objectives and the individual excellence that contributes effectively to their institution's goals. Some of these are managerial development, sales and client services, individual development, technology and operational systems, and credit business. Banco Popular is committed to provide you with additional tools with the best and most recent market practices that will facilitate your development and prepare you for new requirements and continuous changes in their business. For this, you will have within a hand reach continuous development opportunities such as special assignments, training and teamwork, project participation, and opportunities to establish relations with other business areas.